The 2009 pink salmon return to the Nanaimo River was the largest since the inception of a community stewardship program several years ago. The pink salmon, the smallest of the Northwest Pacific species, plays a vital role in the ecosystem. Adults return to freshwater rivers every two years providing food for people, animals, birds, other salmon and trout, and improves nutrient levels in river systems. At one time, pink salmon had been abundant on East Coast Vancouver Island rivers, but over the past several decades, something happened to the pinks. The Nanaimo River run became extinct in 1941. In an effort to re-establish the pinks, Fisheries and Oceans Canada, along with the Pacific Salmon Foundation, began fostering a number of community stewardship programs. In Nanaimo in 2001, 135,000 pinks were transplanted from the Quinson River Hatchery in Campbell River to the mouth of the Nanaimo River. The imprinting of the juveniles was successful and the program was expanded to include three sea pens throughout the area. Gallows Point by the Nanaimo River, at the Pacific Biological Station in Departure Bay and in the harbour by the Newcastle Island Ferry Dog. In 2009, biologists expected a return of 20 to 25,000 adults to the river. What came back numbered over 50,000. Additionally, several thousand milled about in the Nanaimo Harbour area, enabling a successful sport fishery. The bountiful return was not only a boon to local anglers, but to the Nanaimo River hatchery, which was able to collect its own broodstock for the first time. One goal of the stewardship project was to enable the hatchery to become a provider of pink salmon stock for other community stewardship groups and hatcheries in the Central and South Island area. In September, volunteers with Island Waters Fly Fishers, Nanaimo Fish and Game and Nanaimo First Nation waited upstream and corralled a few thousand adults to be held at the hatchery awaiting an egg take later in the season. McCowichan, Englishman and Sable Rivers, Wilfrid, Chef and Nile Creek are other examples of successful community stewardship projects on the island supported by the Pacific Salmon Foundation and Fisheries and Oceans Canada. Returning adult pinks in 2009 numbered over 100,000 in Nile Creek and 3,000 in the Cowichan. The healthy pink salmon return can be attributed largely to a strong ocean survival. But they wouldn't be there without the dedication of many people or without the partnerships that have developed over the years with a common goal to bring salmon back stream by stream.